Say what? Hey, I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you my number, but you gotta edit it out. I'm gonna send you a video you're gonna like. About? A quote that sank the world sent for. Today? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'll send you, I'm gonna send you the video. All right. I didn't say that I wasn't gonna say, I'm live right now on YouTube, dude. I know where you live, bro. Somebody, I'm live on YouTube, you just. That's fine, I can find <laughs> <laughs> All right, listen. Wait, wait. Okay, so, so how did you film it? Like this or like this? Okay, then I can use it. But if you look, send it to me to WhatsApp. Okay, so hold on. But look, but send me, send me on. You follow me on Instagram? Yes. Luxury Rip Tender. Send it to me through there. Send me the, your number there, and then I'll give you my number so you can send it to me. Yes. Then you send it to me on, on WhatsApp. Yeah, yeah, I want to see it. Right, yeah, it'll be cool. Are they all? Is, don't film me on the way in, man. I don't know what I'm doing. Don't worry about it. You, don't, you have any tips, bro? Yeah, hit the dock as hard as you can. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only way you can avoid the chicho. Wait for it. De depends. Wait for it. Depends on how good the clip is. Wait for it. <laughs> Wait for it. Look, she still hasn't got on the fender on. She's. No, don't do that. Why, bro? Why? You, you know all the terms, dude. You, are, you watch everything. All right, so he says that there's a... This poor thing is, st is stressing, guys. Listen, um, the boat ramp ruined marriages, guys. <laughs> and these new fenders... Um, oh, no! It's your fault, honey. I scratched the boat. No, they got it. They got it. Hey, you got a bloop bloop over here, Alfred. Where? Oh no. Oh, there he is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Dude, do we have a bloop, bloop, bloop? Oh, yeah, we do. Look. Number seven. There it is. I'm gonna hold this video against you in case you don't send me the video. <laughs> Wait for it. Oh no. Oh no. He's like, look at number seven. No, but I'm gonna go after you because I don't know if I have that video. Dímelo. Coño. Está bonito un poquito ese, bro. Pescaste algo. No. Whatever. It happens. Oye. Ese bote con un 130 debe caminar. ¿Cuánto va eso? De velocidad. He says it goes 50 miles an hour with that little 130, guys. Wow. No. Five, five miles to the gallon, he says.
Miami-Dade police officer, making sure. Guys, he, let me tell you something. He makes everything. Promote my summer camp. We just had ten, nine weeks. Hey. Nine work weeks, where? Nine weeks, Keep a Skane Aquatic Camp. Where do you guys do it though? Where? What part of Keep a Skane? Uh, next, next to the Yacht Club on the other side of West Point. What do they have to do to uh, enroll? Uh, pay me money. What if you're poor? It's five, kids five to 14. Kayaking, paddle boarding, snorkeling, fishing, keep a skate aquatic we need a We need a discount from my audience, dude. Uh, uh, hit me up, I'll give you a discount next year. Listen, Chicho, if they say Chicho, you better hook him up. In Instagram, at KB Aquatic Camp. All right, well, we'll check it out. Say Chicho, I'll hook you up. All right, guys. Leave it low. Wait for it. What's up? Bro, I love that little boat, bro. I love that. That's all you need right there. Pachanga. Damn. In the house. <laughs> this is too wild, dude. All right, guys. Um, Key Biscayne, very nice area over here. Very wealthy area in South Florida, right? Beautiful place. Um, we actually have some videos of Key Biscayne. If you want to check out my Visit Miami tour uh, playlist, I would encourage you to check out those videos. I, I actually filmed some secret beaches in Virginia Key and little little gems that I don't want many people to know about, but some of you guys that watch religiously will know about those places. Guys, 50 miles an hour on a little boat that size is terrifying. Terrifying. It'll feel like it's a hundred. Literally, I'm serious. Guys, look at this. Yamaha, 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 Yamaha. What are these Suzuki's over here? Suzuki's, Yamaha, Yamaha. You guys asked me, and I'm, the only reason I'm showing you guys that is because you guys asked me, like, what do you recommend? I always say get the boat motor outboard. Obviously, that's going to be reliable because a lot of them are. But if, if you don't have people that can work on them, and you have to wait for eight weeks or ten weeks because there's only one person that knows how to work on a certain type of brand where you live, then that's no good to you, right? So unless you can do stuff yourself, and with YouTube you can, really, you can do a lot yourself. Hey, that water, that water, oil. So it's that bueno. It's good, it's good, it's good today. Oil means today. Um, yeah, um, I would say Suzuki and Yamaha. And that's a Yamaha, you can barely get the engines. You can't get them. Oh boy, these guys are, are chit-chowing. Wow, what, what a show. What a, what a show. A classy show, caballero. Wow, all that drama for what? Um. Hey, let me ask you a question. What made you buy that Suzuki? It's 
So you bought it at Atlantic Marine with Alfonso? Yeah, with your friend Alfonso, yeah. Alfonso. We've done videos with Alfonso. So you like it on the boat? Huh? You like it on your boat? Yeah. Now, let me ask you something. There's two people on that boat. Why is there 30 fishing rods? <laughs> how, how many of those fishing rods weren't touched, bro? ¿Qué clase de papelazo está pasando aquí, caballero? So what is it, a 300? Good. I was just actually talking about that on my channel right now. Because all I'm seeing at the boat ramp right now is Suzuki and Yamaha. They took over. Yeah. So, so, so you're getting a lot of value, guys. Um, the Suzuki's, um, they're known to be workhorses and, they're, and they're, they're priced right, right? And they're available. Most importantly, they're available. They stepped it up during the whole Rona. So they stepped up and they, uh, look, uh, Eddie from Sea Hunter was talking about that while we were filming at the Sea Hunter factory. He was like, look, I got, I got quad 350s on, on Sea Hunters, you know, cats and stuff like that. So, so people wanted to be on the water. And you, think about it, you have all this money you say, I want a boat, and then they say, well, listen, we can make the boat, but we can't get you the motors. What? It's like, I mean, at that point, you start questioning money, right? It's like, what good is your money if you can't get what you need or want? But yeah, Atlantic Marine, guys, they're, uh, they're a local company in Hialeah that sells a lot of Suzuki engines. A lot down here in South Florida. And I did a video. I don't have any biases, right? I don't, I don't care. Huh? I don't know. If you show me some fish, maybe it might get better. Yeah, you guys catch anything? No, I'm here to see why there's $30,000 fishing rods on your boat and no fish. Let's see them. I'm not FWC, bro. Come on. Listen. Hold on. Let, let me call him up on the radio. Hey, we got a blue boat over here with some smallies. <laughs> Come on, man. They're on ice. All right, listen. I, I'm going to follow you guys until you get the cooler off. All right, let's see. Maybe, maybe he pulls out something. Let's see. Let's see. There you go. You see? Look at that. Come on, man. How can you not show that, dude? That's awesome. Now you just made Whitewater look like a, a boss company. All right. Well, when you pull it out, show me. And I, I believe they can have a swordfish in there because they, this, this unit right here is meant for swordfish. And that's why I said, why do you have $30,000? It's not that much, right? But... I, I know that's, that's used for surf fishing. Good stuff, really good stuff. So yeah, guys, um, I have an unbiased video on my channel that shows all the outboard manufacturers at the Miami show. And basically I went to the Miami show and I told every single person on each place, I said, hey, listen, I'm doing a video about outboards. I don't care how or what you say, just sell your outboard and tell me why I would want to buy it. And uh, it's a great video to watch because I used all the companies. Um, so, there it is, right? And I'll do a, a video like that again in the future because obviously the technology has updated. You know, at that time, Mercury didn't have the 600, which um, I think they just had the 450s at the time. And then they came out with the 600s. But I do think, I do really think that Yamaha has, has something in store for us. I, I haven't heard anything, guys. It's just a feeling. It's just a feeling. That um, I think they want to see a lot more Yamahas on their bigger boats, right? So, and, and they have the 425, and we've... We've actually filmed a lot of uh, videos with those 425s.
El campeón. Hola. La gente no salir la cámara. Bro, ¿qué pasa aquí, bro? ¿Qué le pasa a la gente? Yo no sé qué le pasa a la gente, ¿eh? Oye, ¿qué, ¿qué es lo que está pasando aquí? Ustedes no están en el Bad Buddy Concert, no están. Bro, ahorita va. Van para Bad Bunny Concert, no, no, no tienen flow, no tienen nada. No hay flow. What happened? Barcero music, but you guys are not doing Barcero music. You're, hey, Barcero for life, but you guys are being civil. Están civilizados. Ya, you guys got your papers. All right, who was the first American president? Who? Abraham Lincoln. Okay, you're getting deported tomorrow. All right, Washington is right. Okay, who's who's the president right now? Okay, okay, all right. Um, let me see. Let me see. Uh, this you might you might see this in the immigration. So we have a a house and a. Oh my God! Espérate, espérate. Hey, hold on a second. All right, all right, how many senators do we have? We have 100, 100, 100, 100, 135 House of Representatives. There you go, you got it. Listen, who do you want to be, who do you want to be the next president in 2024? Republican for you. No, that's Ron DeSantis, that's a fact. You think DeSantis is going to run? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. How long have you guys been in America? Five, everybody else. Yeah. Five, six, seven, eight years? Okay, well, and you guys all work? Hell yeah. Hard? Yeah. Right? I own a house. And you love freedom? Hell yeah. All right. All right. Well, now, now that doesn't mean that I'm not going to put you on the chicho. But, but here's the thing. I want, I want them to see that you guys have been here five to seven years. You already speak English. Yeah. Right? And you acclimated to America because now... Puedes hablar mierda también. También cuando hace falta. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. Be safe out there. Thank you for, for, for talking to the chit show. From being quiet to our, I don't know, that's our immigration processor. Welcome back. All right, guys. These guys didn't just come in off the boat. They, they've been here. Um, listen. There, there's a... Uh, listen, I think, I think what, I think what the, the channel has shown, like down here in South Florida, every, everything's a little different, right? Um, Cuban, oh my goodness. Wow. That's a mistake, dude. That's a mistake. So here's the thing. Oh my goodness. Why do you do that, dude? That's a bad mistake, dude. That's a bad one, dude. You're crazy, dude. So here's the thing, like. Cuban Americans have been oppressed where they're from. So the last place you want to go is somewhere where you think that that's going to happen again, right? So people want to be free. So, you know, f freedom, it's, it's big. Wow, these guys are in the water. And listen, when I say all this thing about Barcero music and all that stuff, I'm just kind of being very subtle of like, hey, listen, it's probably, it's probably nice of you not to, not just for me, right? Because I'm obviously, I have my own interest because I don't want to go ahead and re-edit a video that has music on it, right? And, and it's going to demonetize my video. So I have, I have, I have a, a vested stake of, of not 
dealing with it. But think about it. You don't want to go anywhere and have somebody blasting their music. And you can't even talk to your friend or mate or whoever. All right, this guy got out. That was that was sketchy, dude. That guy's going to lose his car one day. Or or it's going to rust out completely. Let's see the campeón. So, so listen. I think the point of that for me is that the American dream is alive and well. Freedom is alive and well. And uh, if you work hard, you can have a boat in America. And uh, and you can end up on the chicho if your if your boat can't pull out your truck can't pull out a boat. So so yeah, listen. It's uh it's it's nice to see that, you know? That these young people have worked really hard and um, they're able to have a house. Oh man, another tire. No four wheel drive, guys. No four wheel drive, you're gonna struggle at the boat ramp. Four wheel drive is the king at the boat ramp. We're gonna have jumpers on this one soon. All right, guys, I'm going to end it on that. I'm going to end it on the flag. That ram just came out. Alfred Montaner, guys, making a scene as always, guys. Freedom. It's a beautiful thing. I'm out of here.